Swear, what are you doing? Oh my god. What is going on? But hoodie? Hoodie is giving Masky a Swedish massage. I didn't know you guys were this close. In your eyes. Welcome back to The Sims 4 Creepypasta theme. <laughs> Thanks for that, Ben. And before we start the episode, I have a couple of adjustments and one new addition to add. So first off, I have decided to make Ben a teenager. Why'd you change your clothes? Oh no, is his outfit not made for teenagers? <gasps> All right, I'm gonna have to have Stutter Guy change that up. Also, Ben, what the heck happened to your body? What the heck? All right, that's good enough. I think, uh, yeah, the rest of his CC works, so I'll just have to have Stutter Guy update that to a teen so he can use his regular outfit. But for now, this is good enough. So yes, now Ben Drown can be part of the teen group and hang out with them, being that technically he was uh, a teenager in the creepypasta. Lost Silver is already a teen, but Stutter Guy made it possible for him to have his nubs! Oh my god. His voice. He's got nubs now, guys! So gross. It's gonna look so weird without him having arms or legs. But I mean, now he looks more like his creepypasta character. And now he's a teen. And then I'm gonna be adding one new character this episode. I'm gonna take a little bit of a break from adding characters just for now. And I'm instead gonna work on uh, relationships. Like friends, love interests, things like that. But I have to add it to this household, the new character, because uh, the other household is full so i'm gonna have to put her here and then move her over there but a lot Heart a lot so whoa her teeth a lot a lot a lot of you wanted me to add clockwork also known as natalie and she's gonna be a teen as well i don't have any special custom content for her but we're gonna see how uh how close we can get from what i found on the internet Alright, and here is Clockwork. I think she came out awesome. Uh, I'm gonna give her a dark form, which is just gonna be like probably a blood splatter and uh, a knife. But I forgot to make her a vampire, so I gotta do that in-game and then I'll come back and add that real quick. But anyway, her aspiration is gonna be... Well, before she became insane, she was really into drawing and art, apparently. So let's say painter. Ah. I'll say she was good because she's described as a nice, quiet, polite girl. Ribbo! But then she became insane. <laughs> Perfect. All right, so now she's a vampire. And we can do her dark form. <laughs> and there we go. Yeah. Perfect. All right, and here is Clockwork joining the crew. I also made all of the teens a little bit shorter. All right, well, I think I want to make a club with all of the new teenager creepypasta characters so they can all hang out easily. And I think I'll have Sally. Start the club. Creepypasta teens with a skull club icon, of course. Club hangout will be any nightclub because they only like to come out at night. And we might need to wait till we open these two spots up, but let's see how many people we could fit in. Yeah, we need one more spot. Let's get Ben in there and then we just need lost requirements. Age, you must be a teen. And you must be a vampire. Club activities will consist of being mischievous, Scaring, using vampire powers, and, uh, I don't know, sabotage things, <laughs> and drink plasma. We do not like eating because we can't. We can only drink plasma. We do not like to sleep. And, uh, yeah, I guess, I guess that's about it that we don't like. Perfect! Yay! All right, let's hold our first meeting so we can get enough points to invite Lost Silver. <laughs> Welcome to the first official Creepypasta Teen Club meeting. And everybody's... Wait, everybody wants to go to the DJ? Okay. All right, we need to now do club activities to get enough points to invite our last teen friend. How, how do we go about getting points? Oh, hey, Herobrine. We haven't seen you in a while. Ooh, Sally's here. Now I saw... Oh, very flirty. Everybody's flirty. Oh, oh, hoodie, what are you doing? 
doing? Uh, I mean, that's good, I think. That's what the club's supposed to do. <laughs> I didn't tell him to do that. Whoa, what are you doing here? Where are your clothes? This club is getting crazy. All right, so one of the reasons you may have guessed that I added clockwork was because everybody in the comments really, really, really wants clockwork and Tiki Toby together. I guess that's like a thing. I've heard it before. It, it's like a well-known shipping. So I think I'll follow that. So, clockwork. Scare Tiki Toby. He'll like it. I promise. Whoa. Masky, did you just bite that girl? Good. He'll like it. Like it. Oh, good. See, I told you he'd like it. Uh-oh, now Sally's doing it to this girl. Oh, we're just biting everybody in the club. Show dark form. Everybody should be in their dark form. Well, I think the only people that have a dark form is Ben and clockwork. There we go. Oh man, what happened to the music? Oh, no. Ben, everybody sees you doing it. Ben, you're gonna give our club away. The music and the lights aren't hiding it anymore. Jeez, we're just biting everybody. Everybody in this club. Oh, he's still going. Ben. Ben. Oh, oh, he killed him. He killed him. Oh, God. Maske, everybody just keep biting everybody. They're not gonna invite us back to the club, guys. Yay, the music's coming back. They're all just dancing on him. Savage, guys. Savage dancing on this poor man. You guys are supposed to be getting to know each other. Not drinking from strangers. Oh, yay. We almost have enough to invite our last member. Ugh, this woman is all up in our business trying to steal uh, Tiki Toby away. Look at her. Clockwork, take care of this lady. Yes. Yes, take her out. Take her out. Yes. Oh, what is going on over here? There was lot. There was hearts coming up. What are you two doing? Oh, yes, yes. That's what you get. Stop trying to steal my man. Ooh, Sally and Ben just came up here by themselves. What are you guys doing? I did not make them go away from the crowd together. Maybe they were both trying to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Hoodie's like, I hope I'm not interrupted. Oh, <laughs> now they're just following each other into the bathroom. What are you guys doing? They're like, yes, we're just going to the bathroom together. We do everything together, yes. Wait, what is going on? Are you fixing the toilet? Don't fix the toilet. You're both fixing the toilet? Oh, wait, no, you're sabotaging the toilets. Oh, and she's sabotaging the sink. I forgot. That's a club activity. Do it. Sabotage everything. Good job, guys. Good job, team. Yes, now nobody can go to the bathroom in the men's room. Ben's probably like, I had to go to the bathroom, guys. That's, that's really messed up of you. Oh. And now Tiki Toby's up here. Is this like our club hangout? Ooh, Tiki Toby, yes. Destroy the sink. Do we have enough points? Yes, we have enough points. Okay, add a new member. Lost Silver. Welcome to the club. Now we got everybody. Fight to hang out. We are legit destroying this place. We are sabotaging everything. Look at this. Nobody's gonna be able to go to the bathroom. Lost is sleeping. Are you kidding me? Ah, oh, Rainbow Dash. What are you doing here? How's things over at the Cartoon House? I know I haven't been over there lately. Next episode, I swear. Oh no, it's daytime. Time. I guess we should go back home. End gathering. Everybody go home. It's not safe anymore. We'll gather again tonight. All right, back home. And I think while we're waiting... Wait a second. Masky, why are you outside? You are burning! Masky, get inside! All right, like I was saying, I think while we're waiting for it to be nighttime so we could have our club gathering again with all of the members, I'm going to redesign some of the rooms... Sometimes I just get so angry that I don't even know what to do with myself. How can I deal with things when I can't even do a workout? I, I don't know. Uh, like I was about to say, I'm gonna redesign some of the rooms for the characters that aren't here anymore, like Sonic and Ben and Squidward, being that they moved to a different house. Oh, and Pinkamina. And I'm gonna change those rooms to match the new teen characters we got. So actually the pink room, I think I'm gonna keep for Sally, because she already has like a pink dress on. Masky and Hoodie, I'm gonna have share a room. And Clockwork likes green, so I think I'm going to turn this into her room with some adjustments. There we go, I just put clocks all over, and this is going to be her room. And then, this room will be for Tiki Toby, which I'm going to do black and orange. Easy enough. And this room will be masky and hoodies. It's a rug with orange and yellow, this is perfect! Sorry, fish tank, but you're going, and you... Yellowy orange walls. Perfect. Now everybody has a room. I love how they're walking around like the middle area in unison, Masky and Hoodie. What are you guys doing? This is getting, you guys are getting too close, I swear. What are you doing? Oh my God. 
What is going on? But Hoodie? Hoodie is giving Masky a Swedish massage. What? You guys are getting way too close for your own health. Also, Masky's feet are gone. This is so weird. What? <laughs> You guys are too close. Too close. Samba yelps? Yeah. Ah, I guess they're getting along. <laughs> All right. Woo! Jeez, everybody's getting a phone call? I need to get out. Who are you? No. Who are the rest of you getting calls from? Who is this? How do you know all these people? Are these from the nightclub? Uh, That's up oh, Sally's oh, skills. Oh, we can't find just this. Okay, now she can learn bat form and hallucination. And now I'll save that one. Oh, I can't? I picked it already? Wait. There we go. This one, this one. Oh, I forgot we still have Herobrine's room. <laughs> yeah, we could save that for now. It just looks so cool. I also love the random fountain down here. Come on, be nighttime. I wanna have the club eating. Slender, why are you outside? Slender, Slender, why Why are you? Yeah, yeah, the sun, it burns, doesn't it? You were having your, your coffee outside? Well, too bad, you can only do that at night. Ooh, the romance festival. Hmm, what perfect timing. Let's go. All right, today is a special club meeting because, oh God, how? Whoa, 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 whoa. Too much going on. First of all, yay, Lost Silver is here and looking super creepy with his no legs or arms. Uh, who's this dude? Why does he have a knife? Why is he stabbing himself in the shoulder? And who's throwing petals at us? As soon as we get here, that's so rude, lady. Also, why is Sally wearing her workout outfit? Th those are all of my questions. <laughs> Let's, uh... Oh, it started a club gathering. Perfect. So this is going to be a special club gathering tonight, guys, where uh, we attend the romance festival instead of our nightclub. I'm hoping that we don't burn to death because the sun has not set yet. And I did not realize. But but we'll see. I mean, we're in the shade. Oh, God, it doesn't matter. Well, we'll see. Oh, they're all going inside. Running on his nubs. Lost silver rumin running on his nubs. Where are you going? Dude, where are you going? Hey, where are you going? <laughs> he just came out. They are all just coming out here to, like, complain about the sun. Guys, get inside. Oh, I can't control them. No! Call them inside. There we go. Call the group inside. There we go. It's almost nighttime. I think it is now, actually. Or almost. All right, club, we're safe in here. All right, I think it's just about dark enough. So, I think we're gonna drink some of this. What is it? Socket tea. I don't know. I think it is. This guy is so creepy. His knife is in his tea. In his tea. He's like, it tastes so much better when you bring your own bloody knife and put it in it. All right, crew, everybody come and drink uh, drink this tea that I think makes you flirty. And then we're just going to see what happens. It could be madness. I'm sure it will be. Here they all come. Why are you dressed different? Oh, there we go. Oh, God, they're burning. Why are you guys burning? It's like 730. Very flirty. Sally, go ask about your romantic destiny. Though temptation abounds, you must wait many moons for your destined love. Oh, sorry, Sally. Dude, why are you talking to this creepy guy? Hoodie, why are you talking to this creepy guy? What are you doing? What? Don't flirt with the creepy guy. I mean, I know he's alluring because he's creepy and you guys are creepy pastas, but... Oh, oh, here comes Masky. <laughs> <laughs> this dude just threw petals at Tiki Toby. Oh, Tiki Toby just threw petals at Clockwork. Oh my God, their hearts are going up these two. What, what's going on? Also, why is this creepy guy standing with... Oh, you guys match. Oh, oh, he just keeps throwing petals at people. Oh, he's a teen. I didn't know he was a teen. Oh no. Oh, he, never mind. He just walked right through her. Now what are you, what are you doing? I thought he was a, like an old guy. These two are play fighting. Oh no, it doesn't look like it's going well though. Oh no, what happened? Uh, Sally, I don't know where Ben is. I know he's your crush, but I have no idea where he is. Where'd he go? Oh no, Sally, that fortune teller was right. Oh, they're both hanging out here. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing in here? This is weird. Oh my God. I swear to God, I did not do this. The romance festival is so dangerous. Oh, did you guys sabotage that toilet? Good job. Good job sabotaging. Stop flirting with each other. This is weird. This, I do not approve of this ship. Jeez, I did not know what I was getting into with this romance festival. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Okay, well, I... I approve of this ship compared to Lost Silver Ben Drowned ship. This romance festival is getting out of hand. Oh, poor Sally's all by herself. Sally, go break up what's going on in this bathroom. Or wait, now they're apart. Cool. Ben's by himself. Come watch him sing. I knew you guys were real close, but I didn't know you guys were this close. In your eyes, the light, the heat. 
mean, I guess you're still bros. I, I'm very confused. I'm very confused on what's going on. But, uh, it's cute? Alright, what's going on with the actual relationships I was trying to get? Are these two even... Oh, they got a little bit of a love meter. First kiss? Really? Would that work? First kiss. Let's see, let's see if it, it would happen. Or if he's gonna push her away. Oh. Uh. Wait, you're wearing a face mask. In your eyes. What? <laughs> that wasn't even a kiss. You guys just both kissed your face mask. That doesn't count. All right, what's going on over here? Oh my God. Oh, I thought she kissed him. She just uh, sucks his blood. Okay, that, that's not as bad. His cape is sticking straight up and it looks so weird. Also, every time Lost Silver does something with his hands, it looks like he's levitating something with his mind. He's also super short because he's got no legs. <laughs> Poor Lost Silver. Jeez, these guys don't have any love meter. It's not, that's not working out. I swear, if you have a love meter with Lost Silver, I'm going to be so mad. Ben, no. Oh god, these two are still sitting next to each other. Um, okay. Ooh, these two are sitting together though too. Cute! So the only ones that didn't really get anywhere was Sally and Ben, because, uh, Lost Silver kind of sabotaged that for no reason. By the way, guys, we got, like, no club points. Guys, start doing creepypasta stuff! I'm not even telling them to do anything. They're just... <laughs> okay. And now Ben's running away. Great. Fantastic. Oh, Sally. What's going on over here? Sally, stop talking to that random guy. Yeah, light the fireworks. Do it. Sally, you may not have found love this episode, but at least you can light up your own life. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Ooh. Closer. I think that is where I'm going to leave this episode of The Sims 4 Creepypasta theme. <laughs> Masky and hoodie. Okay, they just they just they just uh stopped looking into each other's eyes. Clockwork and Tiggy Toby are still ta Oh oh never mind, they're kissing through his face mask thing. Didn't tell him to do that. Oh, Ben just glitched out. I don't know where Lost Silver is. Where where's Nubbins? My nickname for Lost Silver is now Nubbin, because he's got them nubs. Oh, Herobrine's here. Where's Lost Silver? There's little Nubbin. As always, guys, if you made it this far in the video, make sure to leave a like before you go. Leave some comments below letting me know what else I should do or who else I should add into the series. I appreciate all of your suggestions and comments. I do look at them, as you can see from the episodes. Whoa! Oh, who is that? What is that? It's like a- oh my god. I need to go see. Lost Silver, this might be a Pokemon. Oh my god, it's like a Pokemon Bendy and the Ink Machine custom content thing. I don't even know what it is. Okay, I keep getting distracted. Where was I? Oh yeah, leave comments, subscribe if you're new to the channel. I put out new videos every single day. And as always, I will Z you guys soon. That character in the back is so weird. So weird. Lost Silver, where are you? Go catch it. Nubbins, go catch it. All right, goodbye.